So finally they're on the board and maybe now it's taking the butterflies away as you mentioned earlier. Oh, nice little duck through move by Ingram. He is very talented. 21st consecutive NCAA tournament appearance for this program. Beautiful spin and set up. Plumley, big finish. Allen handled it on the previous possession. Hey. Top. Jeter, oh, he gets the roll and a foul. Chase Jeter. It wasn't clean, but it counts as two and a chance for three. You can have great pressure up top, but the back man, the anchor of the defense, probably should have jabbed at the dribbler and got back with a great pass right there, throwing it up in better hands with the soft finish. And when you see the double teams by Duke against the Seahawks, you see that tremendous size advantage. And the coast-to-coast -coast play. That is something that Grayson Allen has perfected in his sophomore year. Aggressive going the hole. For Duke to try to keep that short bench together, he's done a nice job sacrificing, distributing the ball, getting other guys involved. And a steal created by Kennard. Ingram takes it to the rack. Timeout, Seahawks. And Chris, that it counteracts the point you were making about UNCW going to the basket. Duke so adept at taking you off the bounce, especially when you're in foul trouble. They're in the bonus. Second foul was called on tally. 16 fouls against the Seahawks. And that was a good defensive possession without fouling on the drive. Ponder hangs and hits. An opportunity for three. Now they're getting to the paint. And now you're seeing the complexion of this game change a little bit. Nice ball fake to get Ingram off his feet. Then a lane to the hole. I asked Coach Keats, I said, what really, what are you telling your team the truth? What do you tell them to make you think that they can win? He said, I run these guys in the ground. <laughs> the exactly. real stuff's coming oh, up. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he's a yell, man. He wants everybody to win. Nice passing on the inside. And the foul. Kaycock with the deuce. And Matt Jones had an uh-oh moment. After the penetration, you take a look going to the side. Jones should rotate down. Oops, I got to get there. Too late. That adrenaline is kicked in, and he says, wait, I need something. I can do this without that mask. Contact. Allen doesn't get a call. The save right back to Allen. Leaves it for Plumley with the throwdown. Injury. Allen a three. Short. Long rebound to Ingram. Get it ahead. Ponder. A follow jam. Chris Flemings for UNCW. Kennard, the trigger man, gets it in for Allen in stride. Met by two defenders. Ingram pulls the trigger. He connects on a three. And we hit the break in a competitive first half right out of the gate in the 2016 NCAA Men's Basketball Championship. UNC Wilmington with a 43 to 40 lead on Duke. One thing we know is that Coach K can call an out-of-bounds play whether Grant Hill is taking it out or Kennard right there. Give that assist to Coach K. Fouls are going to be very important. UNCW has got two guys with three, three guys with two. Ingram, beautiful move by the multi-dimensional Brandon Ingram. Bryce, freshman, stripped the ball. Kennard with a steal. Allen looking to accelerate. He does with a flip to the rim. We're tied at 46. Roll to the rim. Same play. Same result. It's Plumley on a rack attack. Kennard stripped of the ball. On the move. Three on two developing. Fleming's a blast down the middle. The help by Thornton. And the follow goes down. Attacking the rim. C.J. Bryce. And once again, you talk about the barometer of effort. Those, that's one of the barometers following up. They led the Fighting Irish by 16 in the second half and lost the game, 84-79. Oh, what a play! Getting Plumley involved once again around the hoop. UNCW was picked to finish sixth in the CAA preseason play. A block by Ingram. Fleming's one of the bucket. Ingram got him clean. That UNC are trying to Beat them in the take. A stumble by Kennard. And a three on two developing if they work it quickly. Under the Euro step going to the hoop. It's a six point game with 5.20 to go. Duke leads by six and even five minutes to go. Allen races across, gives it up. Plumley! He rocks the rim. Guys at the top got to recognize they got to get below the line of ball and help. The finish and the foul 
Jones is done. And Rice is going to the strike. Are you kidding? There is no quit in this UNC team. The great backdoor cut and the finish right there. England's gotten the ball. He's made something positive happen in that ISO, whether getting other guys involved or getting to the bucket or the free throw run. Allen, and follow jam. It's Plumley. And how often have we said it today? When the big guy for UNCW helps, somebody's got to help him. But Grayson Allen, no quit on the drive, and Plumley finishes for him. Dylan Sherwood shooting 28% from long range. Allen loves it. Oh, and Plumley, the plumber with the flush. I was hoping to see UNCW adjust, maybe. Not go to penetration, send someone else to make the stop. But they continue to help out and not rotate. 